Yeah, that's fun over there, man. Good. Tanya and Brooks. All right, man. I should make you keep doing it, though. These haircuts is $40, man. I should get my money for it. It's only $40. <laughs> I got it started up. It's going to be $15, man. $15 is perfect. Nah, nah, nah. $15 is perfect. Nah, nah, nah. $15 is perfect. $15 is probably legit. You think haircuts? He got Philly prices going on. $15, man. What's the difference? It's a big difference. Philly, 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 Philly like fifty dollars, fifty, yeah, sixty. Right. It is yeah, you right. You yeah. So you think we can survive off thirty dollars? Yeah, you yeah, no question. Get the fuck out of here. Because you're gonna get more clients. That's you know, not true. You, if the price you is going lower, you're gonna get more all right, clients. Keys. That's not true at all. That's true. Ain't that's not true. Yo, I'm gonna tell you why it's true. Look, look. I look, I, I looked at Chris's. I looked at Chris's thing the other day. Mm -hmm. He booked for two weeks. Chris always moved though. He always been moved though. Mm -hmm. Well, he's he always been nah, moved. Nah, nah. If we if he go to forty dollars, he ain't gonna be booked like that. Still be booked. He'll be booked, but not like he is. I'm telling you, two weeks out, bro. I don't want to be booked two weeks out. Two weeks out. Yeah. I, I don't never you ever want like that. that you can't grow like that. Yeah. See the problem with and I'm not that Chris can do. However, Chris do his thing. That's how he do his thing. I can't do that because if I do that, what what happens is you end, you'll never get new clients. Never. All you're doing is cutting the same old people over and over again for but twenty that's a, years. That's a good thing, right? No, what because all right. Here's here's here's, here's, here's the problem. Here's the problem. So. Haircuts two years ago was twenty or three years ago twenty dollars twenty five dollars right now if I never raise my price and all right I'm cutting a whole bunch of people for twenty five dollars mm -hmm. but rent is two thousand mm dollars -hmm. I'm just doing more work for the same money yeah but now you might do less work sure, no for the same money. I do less work for more money I mean well less work for more money sure I, okay. that's the goal. <laughs> and then, and then, then my, my, my book is available is open and I'm available so if somebody wants to come and pay more money they're there they can come in right in but if I'm just cutting all my friends for 25 30 dollars what I believe me I watch these niggas out there do it all the time they be feeling bad and then as soon as somebody like my man out there is sick now right so all his customers are coming to us and they handing us thirty dollars. I'm looking like, what the fuck is this? Thirty dollars, man. That's not love, bro. I get it, but I, I rent two k a month. I get it. I get that. Four seventy, I pay four seventy for my car though. Two sixty for my car insurance. Exactly. Thirty dollars. Thirty dollars ain't gonna do so it. Now, right, now check this out. Check this out. Now, what if I got a show there? Like one person out there. And then that's I, trouble. No, you know, I agree with you here. It should go like that for him. But it don't always do like that. It should though. Why? Because you beef K. You should be marketing. How many people you cut today? How many people I cut today? You got three people today. No, I had three people on schedule. Mm -hmm. I cut five people. I'm good. What? You good? Five people solid. I'm good now. Five people solid. No, five, five, five. no, it wasn't a good day, though. You know why? No, no, no. No, Wednesday is supposed to be... No, my usually my Wednesday is booked. The problem, the reason why I say it's not a good day is because I had to sit in here all day. You know what I mean? Uh, Even when you was cut time, When I wasn't, it's a waste of my time. Yeah, yeah. I, now, for me, I'll be making it up because I'll be trading and Trade, shit. Yeah. But the, the thing is... You know, I like my schedule to be compact. Like, so when I'm coming in, like, I want to be, right, if, either nothing. it's the morning or it's the afternoon, I wanna want to be out. Them. Now, because yeah. Robert's sick, then I got to sit problems. here all day because ain't nobody here to, to cover. Yeah, his, his mm hmm For the walk and shit. Yeah, man, I, I don't know. Five or six a day should be nothing. You don't have like that. I mean, we I mean, got kids. You got plenty of kids rolling around here. I'm not even counting kids. I'm just counting adults that are your solid clientele. You should be four to five of that. You don't come back, Jim. Come on. No, it's inflation too, bro. Which means everybody paying for stuff. That's my point. No, everybody she, ain't. She just told you she had a six hundred fifty dollar card payment. Well, but no, fuck. Well, certain things. No, you're right. But then there's other people not spending. That's what happened. Prices go up. People start holding on their money more. But people also be spending like crazy. No, they do. They did, but then they ain't always spend on haircuts. Nah, certain things like you gonna they pay extra for their sneakers, mm -hmm. materialistic things. Materialistic stuff. Listen, you know? it get busy. Nah, it get busy when there's a party. It get busy Parties. when 
there's holiday. A, a holiday or something. But look, I, I have clients that was consistent every two weeks. Then they go to every three weeks. Some of them come once a month now. That's because it's forty dollars. No, it's not because of forty dollars. It's because fucking gas is five dollars and sure. eggs is ten dollars. Okay. All that. Yeah, it's not us. But the forty dollars plays a part too. No, the point I'm making. Is, I'm telling you, I was on my phone yesterday. Mm -hmm. I was like, I was looking at the point where I said, "Damn, beef wide open." But that cut is $40. So in my mind, <laughs> I'm like this. In What's my mind, I'm going to go see Steph. I was like, I didn't see Steph in four years. But well, Steph is $40. Oh, well, he's out. He's Look. out. That's out. So I wasn't going to see Steph. I, I was about to hit Quentin up. Like, Q, What's good? I need that $25 dollars joint. $20 joint. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, you really shopping by price. I was shopping. Not, not, not by quality. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's cheap, though. Yeah. Yo, I was shopping. He's cheap, though. We had, we had oh, very good. We had to the gym, right? He, his bill came with $2.13. He gave out $2.13. I am cheap. But, but that's how you hold on to money, man. You can't. You just talk that's about people holding on to money. I'm one of those people, man. I man, that's, that's crazy, bro. $40 for a cut. Just think about it. People get cuts, what, every two weeks? That's $80 a month, man. That's a bill, man. That's, that's, that is a bill. It's a bill. It's a necessary bill, though. I don't know if it's necessary. It is necessary. You said, you, I think it's necessary for parties and if you want to look. I got a barber, too. I pay my barber 50, 55. That's crazy. And I was going every week. That's crazy. I would love to be going every week right now, but so the nigga ain't, ain't busy. Think about the, the, the dude, the guy who has him and his three kids. And he got to come in and bring his That's kids. different. That's a, that's a $150 uh, that's, that's for him. Right? That's different. That's different, though. Because we, no, we got, turn that down. Go over it. Tell him to turn that down, Jeff. That calls you $120. Justin, Justin. All right, so Justin, Justin turn that down. Just a little bit. $120? I mean, he takes it out. I don't know. I'll take it out. Probably about $100. Okay. Got to cost him $100 for two kids and himself. Uh, but that's why we got we got specials for people that got kids though. So now you talking about the two kids and him. We got specials though. That's a two hundred dollar bill for him. Can't can't say that. But can't say that. Can't say that. But, a month. Yeah. Can't say that. What? All right. Last time nobody was in here two months ago. Month and a half ago. Exactly. Okay. okay. What I'm saying to you is think about the consistent ones though. Some people aren't as consistent. Nobody's consistent, bro. Nah, there's a bunch of consistent cats, bro. I'm I, telling you. Uh, listen. You know who's a joker who never missed a haircut? Prince. Prince ain't never missed a haircut in, in, in a day. In his you're life, right, bro. you're right. That joker always get cut. You're I right. I won't do that. I, I do I won't do that from every week. Come on, there's, there's, pretty, there's plenty of consistency. Then you take the monthly option. You can pay us about a month. The mom, the mom, look, the mom, you, you can do that. He only pay for it. I pay 35. Every day, you know, every Friday at 730. Mm-hmm. Every Friday at 730. Man, I don't try to, I don't try to afford it. See? That's what I'm saying. 35, you can survive. And then you won't get six or seven days. But see, when, when, when the haircut price, when it, when it, on the price list, when it was 35, they was bitching about that. Well, they going to complain every that's time. It's not high. That's the, that's how much the average, that's what the average was three years ago for the country. I'm talking about for the country. Nah. Bruh, yo, bruh, I'm trying, listen, listen. I'm talking about when, when we was going around to the hair shows and we was meeting other barbers in other cities, they was telling us then that our prices was too cheap. They was getting 35 and 40. Could be Jersey. Yeah. And, I, and I'm, I'm not talking about in Atlanta or... Uh, are we talking Texas? Are we talking DC? Like re regular places. I Maryland. Barbers, man. I'm telling you. I wonder what Zot charging, man. I got to talk to Zot, man. And see what he charging over there. Not everybody can't be a 40, man. I think you might be one of the highest cats around here. All right. No. We we all... Why we can't... Listen. And it, then... Oh, and, and here's the thing. Yeah. What, what you're paying for, too. That's the that's, other part. That's, that's opinionated. That's, that's, now, that's right, right, oh no, I'm going to show you the difference, right? So if you come in here, you make an appointment, you come in, you sit down for two minutes, and you're in a chair, right? You you came here, you parked your car, had no problem parking your car, right? Mm -hmm. You didn't have to walk around the block a bunch sure. of times. You, you don't got nobody in here trying to sell no sure. stuff to you or sure. sell nothing. All that got to get factored in, too. All they gotta get factored in too, man. That's my new stuff. That's, that's, that's not my new. Parking, parking. That's, that's, that's not my new. But a lot of the other stuff is my new. That's not my new, bro. Like real, real shit. I, but that's that's in reference to location and where we stay at. So you, you gotta factor that in. I, yeah. Because I, 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 do I don't work. I don't work in barbershops like that. I got on Nike. I didn't ask Nike for a discount. 
And so why would I ask him for a discount? Underst- understood. You that's his bottom line. And tech suits cost two hundred and forty dollars. It is what it is. You ain't lying. Crocs and I would never do that. You ain't and I will always want to contribute to his success. Sure. Regardless of how good I think he is. Sure. I'm like, all right, this is what I want to do. I want to help build him up. Mm-hmm. Sure. Because I know, again, if he got up and then he could take care of me, he'd definitely be like, yo, Jay, I need this. And I agree, I, I agree with that. But at the now, same time, I, I feel like you're turning people away. Also, some, people, some, some people may be turned away. Absolutely. You know what I mean? Some, some people, people I mean, we don't want. Some, life regardless, I guess, so. some people we don't want, though. All right, sure. But <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's a fact. You don't want no headaches. Yeah, you don't want that. But you do want as much clientele as you can get. Trust I want the clientele that wants me. So, so that's no, but I don't think that's true. You, I don't think you want all the clientele you can get. Why not? You want the clientele that's going to pay your take, price, take care of you, and, <laughs> yeah. and not become a headache ultimately. Mm-hmm. All right, same answer, right? Same answer. Right? You got a guy that got to come like once every two, two and a half months, right? Yeah. That don't say it's it's probably me. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, now, you come more than that. Once a month, yeah, go ahead. Come more than that. Say, like, <laughs> a guy, like, say, say, a guy, Jay, Jay come, like, once, twice a month, right? Jay, like, yo, you got me this month? I mean, I'm gonna just cut. Oh, yeah, got you. But a guy come once, like, he wants, no, fam. Hold on, hold on, hold on, but That's a fact. I think you're doing that with anybody who got good credit. So, like, if I came in no, and said that, no, you I would be like, yeah. You, you, you said, no, I ain't. No, I ain't. <laughs> I'm telling you, <laughs> I'm telling you, bro, you are. I'm, I'm talking about, you know this cat, got he, he get money, he do good. Uh, like, you're going to be like, yo. I Look, the, and on top of that, we got a loyalty card on our app. Same joint. Got a loyalty card. I don't know about the loyalty you, card. Because you don't come I here. I got 10 cuts by now. You, but do you, you need to have 10 stamps in your, in your app. Come on, man. Why nobody telling me about this? See what I'm saying? That, that, but it, 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 See, it's right got, in the app. You got, you got things going on that you ain't letting people know. About. No, we do let people. You're not a regular client, though. I, what you mean? I've been regular for the last three months. <laughs> <laughs> you should have known then. You should have known. Man. I didn't know it's a, it's a loyalty it. card, right? So then, but all right, but then, then that's the incentive. Be, that's to be at the door of the and I am card, a regular, right? though. I'm a regular. But that's an incentive. No, no, but you used to, you used to get your card stamp when you was bringing your son, uh, uh, and so you, you fell off. You know about it. I, you know about it. I don't know about it. I don't know about the loyalty card. But nah, I'm it's a loyalty card, man. Yeah. Joseph's out stamps and not telling nobody. You're giving out stamps. You just got you got to have the app on your phone. You make you make make an account. Nah, I'm sorry. Oh, man, these jokes is getting away with stuff in here, man. That's what they do, you guys. That's crazy. Damn. That's CJ yelling at my kids, man. Hell yeah. How do you got to do it? CJ make you put your card number in on the, on the app and stuff. He's not telling you about the Nah, I don't make it. That was his idea. Nah, it wasn't my idea. You know why? Because mm-hmm. we came back from COVID. Nobody was there. We can't. Mm-hmm. Not even showing up, bro. Yeah. Charge like a oh, that's the way you do it. That's how we do it. Okay. See, real real talk. See, in the beginning, uh everybody else what they do, they make you put a deposit. I don't take the deposit. Right. So, I just say, all right, put your card on file, and if you don't show up without saying nothing, we charge it. You know how many times people don't they don't show up and we go to charge it and they don't have no money in the card? We go over here pissed. Oh yeah, because they use a fake card. They mm-hmm. use the reserve the cut. But I be I be being nice because I don't I don't wanna, yeah. you know, I don't be wanting to charge people. So pre-COVID, did y'all have appointments? Pre-COVID? Mm-hmm. Yeah, we always did. Because uh, a lot of jokers did appointments because of COVID. And I was, you know, wondering when jokers was going to go back to walk-ins. Because you get more money like that, too. Nah, cool. walk-ins, the, the, what, the money ain't in walk-ins, bro. I'm just to be yeah, honest. Yeah. It's no, not. Rushing up on, like, like they I, not. Let's say a back-to-school day. That's, huge, that's a huge day. Back-to-school is right? different. Back-to-school is, all right, let me, let, me, let me show you this, right? When you go to work, right? You got a shift you work, right? Mm-hmm. What's your shift? I work two days a week, two 24 hour shifts a week. Then I'm All right, so when you, when you get off, what time do you get off? It, it works. It's seven in the morning and seven the next morning. Like All right, so when it's, here, here's what happened here. We come in, let's say we come in at nine o'clock in the morning. We're supposed to get off at 7 p.m. If you're sitting here all day long, you ain't do no work. And then at six o'clock, five people come in, then I'm getting off work. At ten o'clock. Mm-hmm. No, that's so not cool. Say it's extra. They walk in. Yo, listen, I caught you, but because you're coming late, it's gonna be ten. You don't want to pay the price that it is now. <laughs> that's me. <laughs> that's our point. I'm different from. But my, my but but that, but that, that's my thing. It's like like we we have all of that available. We got after hour cuts available. So if you want your haircut after hours, you can make you can you can you can. What's that cost? For me, eighty. 
Oh my God. Seriously? If you want me to come back, I'll come, I'll come back here. Listen, there's people. I'll give you examples. Yeah, it's overtime. Yeah. Why can't... Why, why, I don't understand <laughs> Hold on, hold on. We all right. have lives. You so can't deep. compare that. You why can't not? It's the same thing. You have a life, right? Same. You have a life? Yes. We also have a life, too. Yeah. Life too. You know what I'm saying? So you saying you get double oh, just like any other cat to do a haircut after hours? Listen. And there's you, some you, barbers. You, you want to double your time. There, double. there are some barbers that will do it. For instance, Chewy. Chewy will come here at 10 o'clock at night and cut some eye for 40 bucks. I'm not doing it. No, but he's, he ain't going to do it for you. He do it for his regular customers. I'm not, do, I'm not doing that for my regular customers. But what if they come to you? I don't care. Because my point is this. I have a set schedule. Right? So my schedule is set. It's pretty open. Right? I work all day long. Now, if you can't find a way to get in that chair, you can make appointments literally 365 days ahead of time. You can get, you can put go on the app. And you can say I'm a, you could have it automatically every two weeks you come in at the sure. same time, whatever it is. Sure. Now, so if I have to leave my house at nine o'clock, ten o'clock, once I'm home, I'm settled and come back. I'm getting double. I deserve to get double, and I don't think that's too much to ask for. That's crazy, man. That's double. Hey, hey, look, brother just left here, right? All I did was shape. I didn't charge him that. I didn't charge him that. That's what he pays me. Damn. He always paid me that. Crazy. I didn't even do his beard, just a line and his mustache, because he appreciate my services. Now watch this. That's crazy. Is that out there? Who? Ain't no. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, even your services messed up, man. I was off on Tuesday, right? But he called me. Hey, yo, listen. I know you off today. I need, a, I need a haircut. It's an emergency. Me and my son. We can go out of town at like 5 o'clock. It's like 11 o'clock in the afternoon. I'm sorry, cool. That's my Lord. Man, he paid me, right? And he gave me money. I ain't counting. Just put it in my back pocket. So I put it on like, oh, shit. He gave me $300. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But it was good. It was, see, he said it was convenient because you came on your day off. You have to come in. Give him a deal, oh, and you will be my son out. And now we're out of town. Now, yeah. I'm giving you 60 for that. <laughs> Ain't no way. Ain't no way. I'm like, girl, you're 60 for that. I'm like, yo, bro, you didn't have to give me that, bro. You know what I'm saying? Come on, bro. Like, that's, that's, I don't know, man. It just, these prices is a little weird to me. You know, like, y'all be charging the same for a taper and an all-even or a face. Why do you think one is even. easier than the other? All he's doing is the size in the That back. that haircut he just gave you was a hard ass haircut. See, this is the you. easiest fade to do, ain't it? No. See how long it should no. Take. Your I hair is long. Drop fade ain't harder. No. Come on. That's easy as hell. You're when hard. you got that long curly hair up there, that's more work, bro. Nah, man. You're Cut bugging, the sides bro. Down the back. You think it's that? It's not. It's not. It takes long. So it, it took him an hour to do your hair. He's Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there is different fires, but it don't matter. I get paid the same regardless. I'm on the clock. That's not, you know, we can't compare those two. You can't compare those two. If, you, if, that's the, if that's the comparison you're making, then you should get 40 for every cut. It don't matter. If it's a beard, if it's a fucking ball, it don't matter. Man, look, no, no, no bullshit. Rob Dennis said that before. He said it don't matter what cut it is, he get you one, one price. Then, then, yeah. If you're comparing it to the regular workforce, they, they come on shift. They're getting, they're getting a flat rate. Then you should get a flat rate. No, I'm not getting no flat rate. I'm cool with but that. But see, the thing, the thing with me. But then you're not going to be cool with that because I'm going to charge you $40 for a shape up and $40 for a haircut. But you're not going to be cool with that. I'm not. But so if you're comparing it to the, to the regular to the regular people that work in the And we get time to have too. Yeah, you're right. That, you, could, you just said that though. You said if I come back for a cut, I should get double. No, I didn't say that. I don't, like, I, I come back to you. Okay. So, well, well, C's saying I should get double. So... Just like any person in the world would get either time and a half or double. I don't get time and a half. I just get double. And you should you should be the same. A cut, a, all cuts should be forty dollars, nigga. Nah. Shape ups, beards. Mm-hmm. You gotta think about it. When you make two hundred thousand dollars a year. I wish. We gonna walk off now. We gotta walk off, man. Go walk off. I'm just getting my jacket. Uh huh. Hear you? Two hundred grand. I don't make no two hundred grand. That that that's what you got on two hundred grand. I didn't buy it. Now you buy it. You see what I'm saying? He was crazy. <laughs> Yeah, I'm buying this, man. I'm buying stuff. I'm telling you, your whole perspective would change if you did this job. If you did it, I'm telling you. Or, or not even this job. If Even if you was like a, a landscaper or like in any type of job where you, like a gig worker, 
You, you could be a gig worker though. If you if you're I'm a oop, musician, like I play. I, what's all, right, all right, all right. You know what Same I mean? thing. So when somebody asks you, like your rate is going to change, depending on how far you got to travel, right? Yesterday's price and today's price. Uh, that's a good question, man. Um, it depends. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, it, it could depend on travel. All right, that's and and and, and if, if if let's say somebody call you last minute, and uh, then that's yeah, that's. I got. If I gotta learn a lot of songs, sure. It's well, it's, it's, it's the same thing as us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the same thing as us. No question. If you you call me last minute and and and, and I'm at home and you want me to come back to work, the yes. price changes. The price changes. Same. Well, it's the same well, thing. But, I, but what I'm getting at is in the beginning, if I'm called for a gig, like you know, I'm just like my my response is throw me whatever. But once again, that's not my regular gig. That's just like. Don't matter. But this is our regular gig. I know. So I know. Guys, that's what I'm saying. Most, people, most barbers don't have nothing else. I know. You know what I'm saying? That. Most barbers don't have nothing else. So if we're not at work, we don't need money. Right. I get it. But if you are at work and you say my cut is forty dollars, but I'm going for thirty, you're gonna get four more people. It's not always. That's not always. It's true. not true, not bro. True. That's not true, bro. Like here, we're not. That, not we true. got a lot of walking the flow here. But yeah, you're because you're here, you're on the wrong end. You're on the wrong end. Understood. You know I mean? So it's like understood. But, 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 he, but here's the thing. Here's the thing. I don't want that walking clientele that they get there. I don't want that shit. Wait, I understand. So the, the 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 thing is, the people that come here, when they come here. They're coming here because they're tired of that. Sure. That's what I want. They're looking to pay. I want, and here's the thing. Our, <laughs> yeah, and our, our price isn't that isn't that high. It really ain't. I gotta check out the I gotta check out the prices, man. I ain't gonna lie. To you. I didn't know Steph was forty. That's Steph gotta about. be forty. Steph ain't dumb, man. Yeah, yeah I mean, he got no. Shot. And he worth he worth forty. He's a good barber. He's a great barber. Yeah. He's a great barber. He be on time. He gonna get you out the chair on time. Cuts gonna be good. So I'm not saying he's not, but at the same time, I'm saying Chris is worth forty, but he, his Jones is thirty. But I don't know his reason. His reasoning, you know, a lot of these barbers, right? Their reasoning for not charging more be out of loyalty to the client and all. And I that that's okay. Me, I don't have that. I don't have no loyalty. To, I have a loyalty to the business. It could be a number of anything. You know, he, maybe he could be thinking I'm getting more clients by charging for it. But I'll, I'll give you an example, right? I remember, I never I never get, back in the day, right? Um, we, when we was at Miller's, we used to have this barber, I ain't going to say his name, but he was, he was a drug addict, right? And so one day, I'm sitting there, me, Chewy, and Mikhail, right? And I'm like, I said, yo, why does this guy, the guy he was cutting was like business suit looking, like he had a suit on and professional looking dude. So I said to Mikhail, I said, yo, why, why did he go to him? And he was like, why you think? And I said, but mind you, I'm like 16 at the time. So he's like, I said, I don't know, I don't understand. He's like, he get high. And I said, he don't get high. He's like, yeah, he's a fucking fiend. And that's the thing, people are going to go to people that they identify with. It ain't all, just like you said, for you it might be the cut. Right? No, no, him is the price. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. But for you, it might be the price. For him, it's the cut. For me, it might be the convenience. But for somebody else, I might just... Like, there's a whole bunch of clients that go to Robert purely just because he's African. Mm -hmm. He sure. my man. Or somebody might go to the Dominican bar because he's Dominican. Sure. And whatever you find your allegiance for, it ain't usually ain't about, oh, well, they got the cheapest price. Those clients aren't the best clients. The one that's coming because he well, I, I spend less here. They're not coming because they, they'll literally, somebody could undercut me and they'll go to that person. So I want the person that's allegiance to me for whatever reason. They like how I talk or they like that with the same ethnicity or they like that I do drugs with them or something. Like, whatever it is. Yeah, it's what they can relate to. Yeah, birds of a feather. You know what I mean? Yeah, I definitely understand. Yeah, so I mean, when, when, when you see. Chris shop, his shop is pop is probably because of the culture he's got at the shop. People like that culture. People like to come here. They like the culture we got here. That's all it is. Yeah, you're right about that. Right. And another thing, what you talking about, right? So, B-Dress is done up, right? Over there, and you didn't go over, right? So, on the day of the day, you can't possibly cook it. You know how much? $200. Almost $280. Yeah, but that's going to last you five years. Bro. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> I've done it. The clippers don't last enough. Two and a half years? Maybe. Two and a half years. Bro, these clippers be dying, man. Yeah, I'm sure they do, like anything. Like, like them, them cordless joints? They go. And there ain't no fixing them. 
There ain't no like them joints. The battery done. You gotta go to get a new battery. That's part of, that's part of your job. You gotta you gotta support right what you do. Okay, you yeah, gotta, we gotta pay. Any joints? Joints last not even a month. Am I lying? You got to take it back. Not even a month. You got to take it back. Two hundred dollars. You just have to make my money back though. That's the first thing you said. I ain't making my money back. Man. I got to pull out my phone and do the math on this before I go. Let me see. If we do six cuts and 40. <laughs> they ain't always like that though. Uh, five, let's see. What five. Damn. Yo, Damn. five days a week, six cuts. That's 1200 yeah, I mean, we was making twenty four hundred. You making more than me? Yo, real shit. We was making that money back in Millers though. Easy. And haircuts was ten dollars in. That's my point. So let's say you go down to thirty. Now you're going to do nine cuts. No, but you know why we made that kind of money back then in the nineties? Because it wasn't as many barbershops. You don't get. It's a ton of barbershops now. Yep. Right. It's Bruh, a barbershop on every corner. It's a ton of barbershops. Yeah. Yeah. Um, you get your chair and all that. Yeah, I'm, I'm saying, I'm saying, that's that's after the fact. I'm just going on what you're making in one week. Six cuts a day, five days. You get two days off. I gave you two days off. Call it with that. Go ahead, I got it, I got it. And chair right there, 240. I get it. I so get how much is that a month? A thousand, right? Well, uh, 960, something like 40 that. $40 a day y'all pay. Yo. But you make it 1200 a week, and I gave you two days off. $40 a day, you can pay it up. Right. You only take one day off, so let me add. Let me he add. said, uh, you know your schedule. You only take Tuesday off. So <laughs> now we gotta add. We gotta add six more cuts. So you really make a fourteen hundred a week oh. if you do six cuts. Fourteen hundred ain't enough though. What? That's not enough money. A week? No, it's not. Hold on, we got times that by four. You make more than fourteen hundred a week, bro. Sure, I do. Sure. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You can't compare me, man. Why not? Because I'm running into a burning building. That's not comparable. You ain't doing it every week, though. I'm not doing it once a week. I, exactly. But you getting overpaid. No. Look, see? I, I can't overpaid. <laughs> <laughs> like my life ain't worth a hundred and something thousand dollars. Bro, we in here, we we in here risking our lives too, man. How? How? Bro, y'all got all kind of shit in your hair that, that that's harmful. <laughs> life, fucking <laughs> psoriasis, COVID, all that shit, man. Come on, man, motherfuckers got a little danger. That's it, man. Bro, it be heavy danger, man. <laughs> yeah, but well, that's you know people got a little skin problem, man. man bro, right. it, 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 we in here risking it's our lives, the, man. It's not the same, man. No, 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 no. You can't compare that to no firefighter, man. It's, it's, it, yo, we deserve the money we get, man. You deserve money. It should be more. It should be way more, bro. Damn, that's crazy. It should be, man. Nah, I, don't, I can't go with that. See, y'all got to drop these prices around here, man. <laughs> I'm telling you. Yo, the only reason I don't charge more is because I'm, I'm in the community. And I'm being nice. I would love to charge more, bro. You would love to charge just $50 for a cut? Bro, I think it should be more. Yo, real shit. The stuff that I do should be way more. Listen, man, I'm a gigger. I'm a musician, so I get it, but... You know? I do. I'm telling you, I, I, I do. Bro, we, we do more specialty work than anything. It's not... We're not in here giving... We're not doing a lot of little kids with, like, bald heads and shit, like... Y'all doing 30-minute cuts, man. No, we're not really. Come on. He took more than 30 minutes to here right now. He did. No, but I'm saying, yeah. by your schedule... No, the schedule... schedule 30, no. mapped out for 30 it's, minutes. It's 30 cut. minutes of... That's slots. Yeah, that's just to make sure... There's real shit, right? If 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 we actually put in our schedule, the each slot was an hour, then the price got to go up. We only do thirty right, minutes. Yeah, yeah sure. we only do thirty minutes to make sure people can get in. Sure, so they can get in and get a copy. Yeah, but it, it ain't it ain't it guaranteed. Might take 40, yeah, 45. yeah, I get that. But a lot, but your slots is, is set for thirty at forty dollars. So that means if we talking, if we talking shit, you getting damn forty dollars in thirty minutes is crazy. Nobody even makes that in an hour. But we, so so uh, you can't say you're not making enough money. But on a day like no, I'm not making enough money. So cause a day like a day like today, I, I'm not cutting nobody every 30 minutes. It's a difference. So so maybe we need to talk about you should pay the barbers an hourly rate. For what? I don't collect their money. They collect their money. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I don't collect any money. It'd be different if I if I was collecting money, then I could do that. I'm not collect any money. Mm. I don't know. For forty dollars an hour is kind of crazy. It's not even an hour. It's a half an hour. But you don't, you don't cut every. But you don't cut eight hours. For We're not. Yeah, you're not. Doing, it's it's like being a waiter. Give me an answer. One day, I had one drink on one day. 
9 a.m. My book was wide open for me. Some of this is Keith's fault, though. Some of it is Keith's fault. Oh, so it's Keith's fault. Let's talk about Keith's fault. No, no. Keith. Listen, Keith one of the best barbers around here. He don't. He don't remind people though. He's pretty good, man. He's really good. He got good, man. You know why I got good, right? You know why I got good, right? When he was upstairs, he wasn't that good then. Yeah. You know why I got good though, right? I came to him one time and I was like, Nah, I gotta give him some time. Yeah. Yeah. Look, when he came down here. When when he came downstairs, he purposely said, "I want to cut." In between you and Chewy, that's why he, he's way better than. Yeah, yeah, he's because he can look cool. over. He's yeah, he's yeah. Pretty, pretty damn good. But know. here's the thing: he don't remind people how good he is. Real shit. I've been cutting here twenty six years now, right? Everybody know I could cut here. Of course. I still gotta post pictures and remind niggas because if I don't, ain't nobody coming here. Nah, but you know what? I'm gonna be real with you. I got. Nah, it's a fake. It's, it's, this is really? very. I didn't catch you that. Yeah. Crystal posts no haircuts. Step up, and they always book. This different. Yeah. Different culture. But it's no, a different it, culture, it, man. It, it, it's very opinionated too, though. Because think about it. In my opinion, I say to people when people be like, "Yo, is CJ good?" I think CJ's good, but I think he's the best with kids. Like, I think his kids hey, pop, pop the most. I'm the best with kids? Opinion. Yeah, that's my Me? Opinion. For real? Yeah, I think you, I think you, I think you cut kids I don't kids even like really kids. Well. You, you probably don't. <laughs> I just feel like you're, you're, like, not just, like, your personality, but I'm just saying, cutting-wise, oh. I feel like you're the best there. It's, it's funny y'all got those, those, those perspectives. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Because I put absolutely no effort in the kids' cuts. You probably don't. At all. That's probably when it's the best. <laughs> yeah, now that's you're precise and now you're trying to... It's, that's, that's what I mean. Nah, I'm you're getting niggas out. You just, yeah. you just yeah, gone. You just, yeah. That's, it, to me, it seems like. I yeah, appreciate Steph, it. I don't know. Steph been cutting me. He was cutting me in a long time. He's he's like a great barber to me. I, I don't, to me, I don't know too many much people on that level to me. I mean, there's a lot of people on that level, what I'm saying. like, There's only select four or five cats up there. But these cats get the same clientele. Like, I know people that have been going stuff for 20 years. Yeah. You know me? Since he was at Miller. Long time. Joe Bro, I was there when, when Steph, when we first brought Steph to Miller's. Not when we brought him. When he first came to the Miller's. And we were. He's cutting on his porch. Yeah, we, 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 was, we was teaching him back then. So, I mean, like, I'm proud of Steph, man. So, so I think, like, a lot of jokers around here don't be wanting to see different barbers. They want to see the same cat. Get that same edge up. Get that same. So some key, some cats it's just about no, comfortability. Gonna, yeah, true. What I tell you a lot of, uh, about me too, and dudes like, yo man, I booked an appointment. I mean, I, but I know you for I know you forever. I don't want to book an appointment. I say your cousin, you know why? Because if you tell me in time, I might forget to put it in. I might forget to book it. Here. Somebody else might book it. And then you you gonna come in like, yo, not saying it's gonna happen all the time, but it's like, come on, but then then if y'all show up, I don't come. But but that's I think that's an issue, and maybe not for y'all. But let me take it to Chris shop. Mm -hmm. Pre COVID, you were walking to Chris shop nine in the morning. It's right. ten motherfuckers. Yeah, yeah. Now. That's and that's Easy. what I mean by culture. Easy. That's exactly what I mean by culture, though. Because and now it, you can't get a, a, a fucking appointment with him unless you wait a week or two. You know what I mean? But, so I feel like he's missing money. How? It's the same thing. You it's waited, not the same. You waiting four hours. You didn't have a cut, right? Yeah. You still wait for wait. Hold my spot. I'll be back. Whatever. Whatever happens. Yeah, I'm waiting. You still waiting? But but so but. But, but here's my point, right? And I'm, I'm not, this ain't no shade on Chris, right? My point is how how does your shop have the ability to grow? So if if you, the culture is different there. So it's like, you're going to attract the people that don't want to change, right? Sure. We want to pay the same price. We want to be, I'm going to be here, but I don't mind waiting for five, 10 people, right? So now what happens when those people get older, Right? And now you've never opened up for any new people to come in. So, so what ends up happening, right? Like, I'll give you an example. Take me and Chu, right? At one point in our careers, it was me, Chewy, Will, mm -hmm. Steph, mm -hmm. Randy. Mm -hmm. We was all the hottest barbers around here. Mm -hmm. We was all young then. Yep. Now we older. Chewy's still nice. Chewy ain't popping like that. Mm -hmm. Right? It ain't no reason why me and Steph should be popping now. Mm -hmm. There's no reason for that. Other than we open up the, the, the lane so that new people can come mm -hmm. to us. Sure. So, at the end of the day, you'll see barbers 
or not even just barbers, hairstylists too. You'll die off if you don't open up. If you don't create an opening for new people, they're not because naturally, I, I got clients that I've been. I'll give you an example. Fucking uh, Spunk, son. You know Spunk. You work with right. Yeah. I grew up cutting all his kids. It ain't that I'm trash. They like to go to him now because I'm their dad's barber. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Which is understandable. Right. So you you got to have, like, there got to be room for, that's why I start moving on to other stuff. Yeah, different alleys. Yeah, but, you got to have different alleys, man. But, but in my, in my question is this. Do you need that alley? And, and you know, let's go back to Chris here. Do you need that alley if, if I'm booked up for a week or I'm booked up for two weeks? Do I need to make that alley to grow? If I'm already... Probably at my because no, no. All right, here's my point. Because th th this is, I learned this. I learned this from it's it's a dude named um, it's a barber named Ivan Zoo, white man, right? He out of where's he? I know Ohio, or whatever. So I I learned that shit from him because I used to be the same way, cutting the same people all the time. I was at a hair show one time and he was telling us. He said, "Yo, once you get eighty percent booked, that's when you raise your price." He said, "Because what you need to do, you need to get rid of some of your clients." To make way for new clients to come in that have paid a new price. Okay. That's that's the nature of business. Okay. I and I never that. looked at it like that. I used to be trying to be loyal to my clients and stuff. Right. And now I'm cutting these same people. But what ends up happening, and, and yeah, I don't want to say no names, yeah, but yeah. you you look at all these different barbershops and end up closing, it's because they just doing the same thing over right. and over and over and over. Right, right, you don't right. change nothing. And they, they'll think it's from the decor or let me do a commercial. It's not that. You gotta be able Yes. To, to offer new services and at a better price. Because your main people, they looking to pay a new price. Okay, that I understand. Those you know what people, I mean? Those people you've been cutting, they looking to get away from what they've been doing mm -hmm. all the time. So they're not going to pay the different price. So, I, had, I, 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 I had this lady named Robin, right? I've been cutting her. I was cutting her when I first started. <laughs> Every time I run into her, she'd be like, I want to come back to you, but you, you, your price is too high. And I'm like, well, what, do you think I, what do you think you should pay? Oh, I, you should be, I should be grandfathered in. I said, but how do I make money? Right. That, and I like cutting the hair. That's my right. homie. She a walking billboard. Right. But at the end of the day, if I'm still cutting you for $20, how do I make money? You don't. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And you ain't, I mean, you might send me some clients. I appreciate that, you but. Fresh coat walking around. Yeah. Now, my, my, my electric bill is 260 No, mm -hmm. that's, that's a good point. So I, I see what you mean by that, opening that alley. Yeah. To, to raise your price and stuff. Or I like the perspective from, let's say, you want to keep it open. So let's say, for example, whoever owns this establishment, he might try to come in and get a haircut, you cut him up and now you gain a relationship and now mm -hmm. let's say this place is discounted. Mm -hmm. But if, again, if you're just cutting your consistent people, you never will be able to meet or see right. these extra bits. Mm -hmm. So that's the point of expand, I think. You're yeah, yeah. That's, that's, that's true. I Yo, it's, it's people, it's, it's chicks then. I got a girl came here three weeks ago from the Bronx, bro. Drove all the way from the fucking Bronx. They had somebody come from Maryland. Have people come. I got regular clients come from Blackwood, come from North Jersey. You know, so like if if my book wasn't available to be open, they'd never be able to get in. Yeah, I mean, I feel you. You know what I mean? That's, that's just, you know, people coming all over is just typical word of mouth. Let me check this dude out, you know. Because when I want to get a premier cut, I'm going to go see cold cuts at the World Chili, you know what I mean? Somebody cold was a good barber. Oh, cold legit. Good barber. Cold that's my boy. True, no question. Mm -hmm. So, you know, people do that. But I, I do understand the, the expansion part of it that some people just are comfortable. So you cool playing cold cut, but ain't cold cold like yeah, 60. Cold, cold 60. Cold is 60, bro. Yeah. That's like a, that's like a, I'm going somewhere, party type of thing or something, you know. What's like, your face on here? Huh? You talking so, about so, all right. So, no, here's no. the point. So, if, and this ain't no shade to Kobe, you think if Kobe, and this ain't no shade to Kobe, you think, you think Kobe cuts better than Chris? Or Steph? I like them two cats, man. Um, <laughs> a pinch, a pinch. But they, they, they all right. They, what they, about yeah. what about what Cole does? You think is better? Is it the and I, I'm not. I'm talking about skill level because it might be a service thing for you. That's what I say. It's perspective on no, every. It's not really a service thing. I feel like it's his uh, like it's just his approach and how he goes at the cut. This is service. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's what all right. Saying. You gotta pay for that. Is my point. <laughs> I guess so. Whatever. I mean, I don't have a problem paying for it because it just it comes out the way I, you know, the way I like it. Like his cuts. Are this is insane. So you 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 go down there, right? He's gonna he gonna cut you. He gonna shampoo your hair. Mm -hmm. He gonna um he gonna put the the the, the little 
enhancement on your fit on your head, mm-hmm. and you will walk out there feeling like a million like million a bucks. Yeah. Now, what I mean by, but his skill level just on just pure cutting hair isn't better than Steph or Chris. It might not be, but I wouldn't even know that. You I wouldn't know, know because, because you're going for the service. Yeah. So here's my point. Now, take us. No, 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 it's not. That, but this, this is service. Right. I'm glad you, you brought up Cole. Because now, this barbershop, probably us, I don't know about everybody else in Steph's barbershop, but Steph's particularly, we offer more services than most of the other shops around here offer. Our price should be way higher than what it is. Sure. Nobody shampoos your hair here. Sure. I mean, uh, oh, nowhere else. We sure. do that. Mm-hmm. You know, we, we, we the ambiance, like everything, everything factored, <laughs> factored in together. We do enhancements. We do all that shit. Yeah, you're right. You're right. So why should our price be less than? Cool. Exactly. Um, maybe because he's in a different area. That's the only thing I can think about. <laughs> he's in Swedesboro. Yeah, I mean, that's damn near Philly, though. That ain't popping. I ain't saying it's popping. I'm just saying he up there. He, he he close to Philly, so he probably get those prices. You know what I mean? I don't think a lot of Philly cats. So. You, you, I mean, you might he might get cats in Philly, but my, my, my point is the location don't change. The service is the same. The location changes everything, though. Gas is different everywhere. No, nah. I'm talking about I'm talking about the quality of your service. It ain't going. Yeah, it doesn't change by location. It, but but gas going in your tank don't change either, man. But it's different price everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> location change everything. You feel me? You I don't get so. paid the same as a, fire, a firefighter in New York. You <laughs> get paid more than most firefighters around here, though. I'm, I'm, yeah, we're up there. But I'm just saying. <laughs> what I'm saying is I don't get paid the same, and I don't get paid more than most. Market make more than me. What trash at? Make this. But I do, I do, I do, I do get what you're saying. The services make a difference, especially if somebody shampooing your hair. That's that's worth more money. Yeah, we we shampoo everybody. Yeah, that's that's definitely worth more money. I don't think beef shampoos you because you know you weren't going to pay them. You know no, I pay. But you know how to wash my hair. That's what happens. You know how to wash my hair. Yeah, nah, I pay. Come on, man. I'm gonna take care of the cat. Like like Jay said, man. You know you got you got you want to see people be successful, so. That's what I'm on. No, we, 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 pre- we appreciate you. Ain't nothing wrong with being cheap, though. Cheap, man. Listen, I'm cheap with a lot of stuff. I'm cheap with a lot of stuff. I can't. When I see $40, that should just rub me the wrong way a little bit. I but you see like, 60 on on cold joint and have no problem. I, it's different. You know, when you go to oh, I'm, I'm, What I'm trying to tell you is when you go to cold, you all that's in your head is like, I'm about to go to this party. I'm going to be fly as shit. All right, let me ask you this. If, if, if. And let's say you lived in Paulsboro or Sweet down that way, right? Would you go to him every two weeks? Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> you crazy? Hell no. I would be finding somebody to cut my shit for 30. <laughs> yeah. He's a All right. Cat. Yo, that's funny. <laughs> so he, he's a special occasion. He's a special occasion. That's why crazy. Think, that's what I'm trying to tell you. Why you think beef, I, I be coming once a month. I let my shit wolf for a little bit. All right, that's a compliment then. Feed me, feed me. There's a compliment, man. <laughs> I got to hit him with the one smoke. That, that 80 killing me. That's a, uh, that's, that's an electric bill or something. I can't do it. You know what I mean? But if he comes down to 30, I got him. It will be two times a week. So now he make an extra $20. So so what what, what if Kobe was $30? Would you go to every week? I'd be driving up there. You morning. drive down there every yeah, week? Every week. I'd be driving <laughs> on the expressway. Facebook. But you spend, it, you spend it in gas. Fuck it. It's worth yeah. it. So, talking about $40. Basically, I'm $40 cut. Shit worth it, man. Cold night, Crazy, man. man. Cold like that. Yeah. It's all good. I don't pay the $40. I ain't mad about it. Yo, some people be mad about it. I ain't mad about hey, it. Yo, hey, yo, we went from um, 15 and 20. I had a do argument. Yeah, but... Mm-hmm. Y'all, I'm, I'm, I don't know when the haircuts change. I want to say... For me, I think I was paying twenty dollars two years ago. You probably was. I think I was. Yeah. When I was going to prison, I was paying. I was getting twenty five. No, but he went up since then. Like, yeah, that's I good. Looked at his appointment, but he definitely went up. Yeah. Cause he a couple years ago he was only twenty bucks, but now he's thirty. So he he definitely expanded too. But like, he ain't where y'all at. But he don't shampoo. So once again, I said I said I said different added service that he don't do, and he ain't got time to do. He got. You know. He got time. If he if he would do it like we do it, he got time. Maybe. 
Oh, it's just him there and Razor Brick. You know what I mean? They got a lot of. They got a lot of Razor Brick over there. Mm -hmm. Razor Brick over there. That's good. But he weeks out, man. You know what I mean? He weeks out, getting that money. I'm out. I gotta go to fucking.